Um, right, okay. I just want to introduce you to the next little task that I'm doing in my home studio, and that is taking some lovely pictures of this popcorn. I've got three bags uh, from a company called What's Pop Poppin' in Northamptonshire. This um, flavour is cocoa caramel. I've got mango caramel and salted vanilla caramel, and they are selling these for £2.50, and they will deliver these to your door. So I've had these three kindly delivered to me from this company, which is brilliant. Gives me the wonderful opportunity of being able to take pictures of their of product. Um, and the point of this video is just to show you a few things that I do. So whenever I've been given a product, I consider what the product is um, and how best to take the picture. Now I will take some singular pictures of each individual product um, within the packaging okay but i also like to take uh, more stylized images so as popcorn for me links to watching a film going to the cinema um, and eating them as a nice little treat um, I also looked on the website for What's Popping, and they are also currently promoting a bigger selection of popcorn that you can buy and have your own in during isolation cinema evening. Not saying that you wouldn't want to do this after isolation, but it's a really lovely idea. And this is linked to what I want to do when I take the pictures of this popcorn, is I'm going to do a styled photo shoot that is linked to the theme of cinema so i have made these little cinema kind of shaped boxes so there's three of them there you go I've got three and i've also um downloaded some interesting kind of like old kind of traditional cinema tickets so just like little props that i can include into the shoot to add to the theme and all I all I did to do this was I simply downloaded or found a template, and I don't know if you can see this here, a template for this box shape. And then to link it to the company, I added in their logo, um, and I also then decided that I quite thought well, I kind of thought it looked quite nice with the green and white spots because obviously their their colouring is all about green and white. So I thought, well, that'd be quite nice. It links to the company's logo. Okay, and um, so that's kind of what I've done. 